All right. So for today, I would like to start our discussion with a short question. Have you ever joined a running event? Nakapag-join na ba kayo sa mga marathon? Hindi pa? Like yun sa mga school activities natin, alam ko kapag sports fest, nagpapamarathon tayo. Yung iba yes, nakapag-join na. Yung iba wala pa. Ayo, oh, sa bagay kasi you're still so little <laughs> during those times na may marathon tayo. And I think ang mga allowed nang sumali doon is yung mga grade 5 and grade 6 students. We were still grade 1 back then. We were face to face. Ayo, <laughs> iba kay grade 2. Alright. So, it's really a fun activity. Aside from it's fun, it's also healthy because it exercises our body kapag tumatakbo tayo sa mga gantong events. Alright? So just like humans, computers also run. Do you know that? Alam niyo bang tumatakbo din yung mga computers? Ingatan niyo yung computer niyo, baka mamaya. Iba na kayo niya. <laughs> computers also run, but in a different way. Paano kaya tamatakbo yung computer? Siguro patalikod yung takbo ng computer. Kasi different way. We'll find out later. So, our objectives for today's class are as follows. First is to describe what is a system software. Second, to describe what is an operating system. Next, explain how operating systems make the computer work. And lastly, to explain other computer system concepts. Are you now ready for our discussion about this subtopics? Okay, so the title of what would cover our second quarter is the stuff that you can attach. So meaning, ayan, today we're going to talk about what keeps the computer running. <laughs> Pakicheck yung mga computers nyo kung may mga paa at mga mamaya habang tulog kayo. <laughs> Maninag na sila na gumaga dito. Alright. Yes, Shania. Have you ever seen your computer running like this? Teacher, I know what kind of running computer is doing. Very good. Well, hey, is it like this one? I not this one. <laughs> okay. So, oops. So, in the question, what keeps the computer running? The answer is the system software. Are you familiar with the system software? Not yet. Later on, we'll find out what is a system software. And about system software, can you read Georgia? System software are the programs that that let you manage, maintain, and control the computer. Okay. So these are the roles of a system software. Sabi dito, these are programs. Sabihin, these are things inside the computer. Okay? That let you manage, maintain, and control the computer. So yung pagtakbo ng computer, as what I said a while ago, it is different sa pagtakbo ng tao, okay? Kasi ang concept natin ng tao, di ba? Pag tumatakbo, mabilis na paglaan. <laughs> di ba? Pero ang computer, it runs in a different way. Pag tumatakbo yung computer, ibig sabihin lang na gumagana yung computer, okay? And these system softwares are what makes the computer running because it manages, maintains, and control the computer, okay? There are two kinds of system software. First is what we call the operating system. And second is what we call the utility programs. Have you ever heard these terms before? Operating system, yung OS na tinatawag natin, and the utility programs. Not yet? All right. Okay, let's discover. Teacher, ano po ba yung operating system? Kindly read. Jace. Directs the flow of data to the form. To and 
to and from the processor and the computer memory. It runs until the computer is shut down. Okay, thank you so much, Jace. Okay, as what was said here, it directs the flow of data to and from the processor and the computer memory. Diba? Before we have studied the mga functions na mga parts of the computer. And we have learned that we have input devices, we have output devices, and we have processing devices. Actually, processing device, kasi isa lang yun. And it's the system unit. So, since it's the brain of the computer, so, dyan din nag-work usually si operating system. So, what is being done by the operating system inside the system unit is being seen in the output device, which we call it monitor. So, kung ano nakikita natin sa screen natin ngayon, lahat ng yan, gawa ni operating system. It runs until the computer is shut down. So, kung 24 hours pinapagano ng computer mo, hindi mo na pinapatay, abay, maghapon din na nagtatrabaho sa operating system para sa iyo. Okay? At take note, ha? Kapag ganun yung ginagawa niya sa computer niyo, mas madali siyang masisira. Kasi nga, we can compare the computer to a human being. Kung ang tao nga, napapagod, yung computer napapagod din. So, kailangan din yung computer na pahinga. Okay. While it is running, it makes sure that ano yung mga ginagawa ni operating system habang tumatakbo siya, kindly read Sachi. The computer receives and understands the com commands you give. The computer doesn't take a long time performing giving commands. The computer ke keeps track of all the files stored in it. You are alerted of possibility systems, problems, or if there is a system failure. Okay, so as what you can see, di ba? Ang daming trabaho ng operating system. So para siya mismo talaga yung pinakamaliyo ng computer kasi ang daming tasks na nakasign sa kanya. Just like yan, receiving and understanding the commands that you need. Yung mga in-input mo na data. Siyempre, siya yung nagdadala niya sa system unit at siya rin yung nagpaprocess niya. No? Imagine how difficult is that. Uh, siya rin yung tumutulong para magpabilis yung loading. <laughs> Ito, parang siya yan mismo, di ba? No? Pinapabilis na yung loading ng files. So, siya yung nag-transfer ng mga files na pinatasa kayo mga from a USB o kaya from a disk, from a hard drive. It also keeps track of the files na nag-ini-store mo doon sa computer. No? Siya rin yung gumagbar dyan yan, sa mga virus. And kapag may mga posibleng maging problema, ayan, siya rin yung nagsasabi sa iyo, Ops, boss, natakit tayo ng virus, baka naman may bigla ka mamatay at ang ganun yung role niya as the operating system. Okay? Aside from that, the computer structure that uses a particular kind of operating system is called a platform. Okay? A platform finds out what kind of software will run on the computer. Okay? Ito dagdag to na, kung, na security ng computer. Ito tinatawag natin na platform. Okay? Dito nagtatrabaho si operating system. It also checks how the computer performs all its activities. So, napaka-importante ng role ni platform. Kasi siya yung katulong ni operating system sa pag-secure ng safety ng computer. Okay? There are two types of operating system. One is what we call a graphic-based operating system which uses what we call WIMP or Windows Icons, Menus, Pointers, and Pull-Down Menus concept. And we have what we call the command-driven operating system. It uses naman text codes to access the computer programs. Okay? Kaya ano pinagkaiba po yan? Sig 
Cryptographic based operating system, ganito yung itsura niya. Ayan. So, usually, yung mga common types ng users ng computer, they are using what we call the graphic based operating system. Yes, Shania? Teacher, that kind of look like the one that looks like the, the thing and my start button on the laptop that I'm using for. What? Um, again, the colorful, the colorful things for that almost look like the things in on the start button of of the laptop that I'm using for. Mm. It's also part of what we call graphic based operating system. At what, as what I said, itong picture dito hindi lang naman yan yung picture ang graphic based operating system. It's what you can see in your window top. Yan, yung sa desktop ninyo, kung ano nakikita nyo dyan, that's graphic-based operating system. Because, sabi ko nga, ito yung pinaka-common na ginagamit ng mga users ng computer kayo. Because the other type of operating system is like this. Ayan, na command-driven operating system. It means that you need to include codes in order to make the computer function. Actually, before, get to lang yung system na mayroon yung computers. Everything is command-driven. Pero, as time goes by, syempre, nag improve ang knowledge ng tao sa technology. Nagkaroon ang tinatawag na graphic-based operating system. Pero, teacher, ibig sabihin po ba nun, wala na, wala na computers na meron po command-driven operating system? Of course, hindi po. Kasi po, yung mga experts na sa computer, they are more comfortable in using the command-driven operating system when using computers. Okay? So, pang-experts yan. <laughs> Kung hindi pang-lola or pang-lola. Okay? So, let's go now naman sa utility system. Ito, napaka-short lang nito at napakadaling intindihin. What is a utility system? Kindly read. Kindly read. Keep reading. Rearrange and clean files, make, making sure the computer runs properly and that problems are fixed immediately. And, oh, the operating system, yung total na tatrabaho na almost lahat sa computer natin, si utility system naman, siya yung parang janitor. Na siya yung naging linis, nag-aayos ng mga files natin. At siya yung sumisigurado na yung computer ay tumatakbo na maayos. At yung mga problema ng computer ay naayos agad-agad. Okay? So usually, ito yung mga pinatawag natin na antivirus. So, ayan, sila yung talagang hired na experts na security guard ng computer natin. That's why sa mga computer na ginagamit natin, usually, kapag mag-aamay ka ng antivirus, may bayad. Kasi nga, extra protection yan for our computer system. Okay? Clear ba sa atin ang utility system? Alright. So, let's wrap up. Everything that we have discussed. So again, the system software is the one that makes sure that your computer can do a lot of things at the same time. It is made up of an operating system and a utility, a utility program. There are two kinds of operating system, the graphic base and the command driven operating system. Okay? Are there any questions regarding these things that we have learned today about the system software? Bala, are you sure? Okay. Right, kung wala, then let's proceed all at once to our activity for today. Okay? This is going to be very simple. Okay? Hindi na natin gagawin to in our notebook, okay? So what we're going to do is just to fill in the blank 
Ayan, Ayan na nakikita nyo dito sa inyong screen. Okay, so we're going to read each sentence and you're going to fill out the blanks in the following statements. Are you ready for this activity? Okay, again, hindi na natin gagawin sa notebook ha, pero kung gusto nyo mag-take down notes, then it will be okay. Are you ready? All right, let's start. Number one. <laughs> Programs that allow users to manage, maintain, and control computer resources are called blank. Yes, Jace. Are we going to copy po the whole Hindi sentence? Hindi po. Hindi po. Ay, if you want to do that, you can do that later kasi nasa ends na naman itong lesson natin. Okay, kala ko na itataas ka ng kamay for number one eh. Oh, who knows the, the answer for number one? Wala! Hala! Ah, Gia. System software. Very good. It's the system software. Number two. The blank programs make sure that the computer runs properly. Oh, what kind of program is that? Mm -hmm. What kind of program is that? Make sure that the computer runs properly. Uh-huh. Anyone? Ito yung last na dinuscuss natin. You, it's the janitor of the computer. Yes, Sophia? Do we still have to copy it to notebook? No. Again, number two. What's number two? Oh, si Liam lang, nakinay. At nag-take down notes. Mm -hmm. Who knows the answer number two? Tanong ko, anina? Kung naintindihan ba? Sabi, oo, pag umuho ko, dalawa lang yun, hindi na itindihan talaga o walang itindihan. Again, it's the janitor of the computer system. Yes, boss? I think it's still the system software. System software? No, it's not. But thank you for that answer. Wala na, sinuyo na lang talaga. How about the others? Nakaw. <laughs> nakaw, nakaw. But next time when we have class, make sure you have your notebooks with you, ha? Kasi pag ganito, o oh, on the spot, paano na, o recorded to na sit work or quiz. Hmm. Wala tayong sagot. Wala nga. Ah, sige, Liam. Ro the running program. The what? Running program. The what? Sorry? Running. No. Hindi rin pala alam ni Liam. Oh. No one would like to answer? No one knows the answer. It's the yes, I did. Operating system. Sorry. The operating system. No, it's not the operating system. Ano pa yung isang type na system software? Yes, Sachi. Uniquely. Uniquely, no, it's not. 
Georgia, are you raising your hand about it? Okay. <laughs> it's the utility program. Sayor. Sabi sa inyo, yun yung last na dinis-class natin eh. Oh. Next. The black uses the wind concept. Clue. It is one of the types of the operating system. It's the what? It's the most common one that almost every computer user is using nowadays. Yes, lovely. What is that? Graphics-based operating system. Very good. It's the graphic-based operating system. Next. Number four. A block is the computer architecture that uses an operating system. Saan nagtatrabaho sa operating system? It starts with letter T. It's the what? Yes, Kian? Platform. Very good. It's the platform. And lastly, number five, the blank uses text codes to access the computer programs. Computers programs. Yes, I did. Command driving operating system. Very good. It's the command based operating system. Di mga pang experts, sa mga pang lolob siya rin siya. Mga panahon ng kanila yung mga ganyan. Okay? So clear na ba tayo about the lessons natin ngayon? Again, please, please, please review all this because surely I will be including these things in your quiz. All right? So for your activity tomorrow, so you will just answer play up on page 36, letter B and letter C. Okay? Are there any more questions? Clarifications? Violent reactions? Meron bang mga natutunan na bagong terminologies? Yes, one? Um, are, are we gonna do that tomorrow? Mm, pwede niya rin pong gawin ngayon kasi we still have remaining time na yun. But you can work on it as soon as you will see. Teacher, are we gonna send the notebook to Quipper? What? Are we gonna send the notebook? The notebook? Why the notebook? No, um, sabi ko kanina, we will answer it synchronously. So, hindi ko na ipakasubmit kung sinulat ko ng sa notebook. Yes, Sophia? Teacher, are we gonna do B or C? B and C, both. Okay, are there any more questions? Right? Okay, if there's no more questions, then I guess that will be all for now. Thank you so much everyone for listening and actively participating. Goodbye and thank you everyone. Bye. Bye. See you next week. Bye. 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 Bye.